Our next stop, Houston, Texas. This is our nation's energy capital where industry leaders are building and shaping our Earth's future. But right now here in Houston, it's all about rebuilding homes. We've all seen the devastation from the flooding of Hurricane Harvey. And right now, companies are stepping forward to rebuild lives. Let's take a look. Economically, it was this country's most destructive natural disaster to date. Hurricane Harvey not only destroyed lives, it destroyed communities. We had the same rain in a year and in four days. Uh, you know, over 50 inches of rain. And uh, you know, in KBR itself, we had over 300 families that were disaffected and uh, many of them flooded out completely. Many have lost their homes, lost their you know, worldly possessions, things that are really important to them. Today, companies like KBR are stepping in to not only help their employees rebuild their lives, but also the entire community. We are a family at KBR. We've started a relief fund. Uh, KBR itself contributed half a million dollars to that immediately. But what has really been uplifting is the response from the wider KBR family who have really stepped up and contributed personal funds to that, to that fund and, and, uh, and that's starting to have a positive impact on the families directly. But then KBR already has a proven track record in caring and innovation and rebuilding and completing projects in a sustainable way for companies like Chevron, especially in the clean energy field. Our vision for clean energy is uh, LNG and natural gas uh, in pipeline form, uh, shipped all over the world, put into combustion engines, conventional vehicles. They'll burn well, they'll burn cleanly. Sustainability is absolutely central to what we do. We believe that really for a long-term sustainable future to, to really the US, but also to the planet going forward, there has to be alternatives to, to current fuel choices and, and we believe that that fuel choice is gas going forward. And KBR has positioned it and been a pioneer in the LNG industry and the, I guess the, the gas industry. As the world seeks alternatives, gas is a natural choice for abundant clean energy and KBR is at the forefront of this industry. But providing this clean energy is complex. It means developing LNG facilities for its customers in some of the world's most demanding and environmentally sensitive locations. Well, the interesting thing is that natural gas is one of the most abundant molecules on Earth. But ironically, it seems to be in difficult places. It's in deserts, it's under the sea, it's in jungles, it's in the Arctic, uh, and then occasionally in places like West Texas. And the latest endeavor to provide us clean energy? The Chevron-operated Gorgon Project, a world-scale LNG project on Barrow Island, about 37 miles off the coast of Australia, and one of the most environmentally challenging locations ever encountered. Gorgon is a very unique project. It's one of the largest LNG projects ever built in the world. It's in a Class A environmental reserve, it's got some unique features in terms of wildlife that actually exists there, in that which doesn't exist anywhere in the world. This Chevron-operated LNG project established the world's largest non-government quarantine management system to protect the island's unique environment. KBR played a key role in the execution of this project. We had to take special measures in terms of planning the execution as well as doing the construction of the plant as well. To get there, you have to fly in uh, to get across to that site. Protecting the environment and our wildlife while still bringing clean gas to an ever energy hungry world. That's a recipe for sustainable success in rebuilding our world as well as rebuilding our communities. I'm John Holden. Thanks for watching.